Hey Earth Signs, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, welcome to my channel and thank you for being here for your reading. We are going to be looking into your future, my loves. So we're going to see what's coming up, what's destined for you, what will your future look like and some wonderful things that you can maybe look forward to. Um, so this is going to be for the Earth Signs watching or maybe if you're a cross watcher dealing with an Earth Sign, this can be for you. Uh, and we'll see what your future is going to look like using these two decks. Okay, some wonderful little um, signs here hopefully um also uh anyone that wants to become a channel member please feel free to do so via the join button um if you want to get access to bonus readings and member only content it's a monthly subscription so head over to the join button on the home page otherwise um feel free to subscribe to the channel to get updates for readings for your sign or your element um also anyone after a private reading please email me i am currently accepting those so i'll send you over those booking details once you reach out Otherwise, that's a lot of announcements. It's a mouthful. It really is. Let's have a look and see what your future is going to look like here. Okay, this card is dying to come out. Okay, good. You're going to be getting rid of a lot of mental fogginess, anxiety that you're currently going through. That's all going to go. Okay, I'm seeing a destined marriage, destined Taurus coming in for some of you. Okay, Queen of Cups is reversed. Okay, Leo. Leo's come up, but Leo is reversed. Okay, so things may not necessarily work out with a Leo. Some of you are connecting with a Leo. Or there's a management position, a position of strength. It's not in your future for some reason. There's other things that are in store here for you, fire signs. Leo's could be more for you. Um, okay, so the strength is reversed. Let's get a little bit more messages. Okay, some of you have a very important wish, the dandelion, very important wish that you want to fulfill or you want it to come true. It's in your future here, fire signs. It's something very near and dear to your heart, I can see. It's possibly something you've wished since you were younger or a child, or if it's around pregnancy, children, adoption or fostering or working with children. Children are definitely in your future here, so that's a very good sign that that could happen. Okay, but I'm back to this wish. It could be around an asset, a job, a family situation or a love situation, especially marriage or engagement. I'm seeing that that's in your future here. So that wish is going to come to fruition here for you. So that's wonderful to see. Um, I see two potential job roles here or two income streams in your future. So a lot of you are going to be dabbling from something from home, like your own creative pursuit whilst working for someone else. Or you're going to have one business idea and then you're going to start another. But I actually see you juggling multiple income streams. But I see you being um, I see you being very well off. I'm seeing lots of finances coming in around you and you being very, very comfortable financially, which is absolutely wonderful. I think it'll have something to do with collaborations or these multiple businesses. Some of you are destined to start a business or an online thing with your spouse your future spouse and i feel like you're going to work together and create something very lucrative uh it's something that you don't know about yet though it's an idea that they could inspire you with and then you sort of build on it and make it happen now you're very good at doing this uh, earth signs you're very good at executing ideas um someone else might be sort of come up with the ideas but you're gonna make it happen you're good at implementing and actioning ideas and i feel like that's going to bring in a, uh, a lot of wealth here for you. Okay. Knight of Wands reverse. Some of you had plans to study in a different city or move to a different city or have a long distance relationship. The travel cards are reversed, which is telling me something's not going to work out. Um, things might be cancelled. There may be delays. You might change your mind. Um, you might end up falling in love where you are. You might end up getting a scholarship where you are. It's like... You'll have plans to almost move or almost relocate maybe to a home, but then like a different home offer pops up or you get a good price at a home auction or you get a scholarship or a last minute job pops up. You know, someone's quit and then the job pops up again. It's almost like 
you'll be so close to making plans to move or relocate or maybe be with someone long distance uh, and, and move for them. But that's not going to take place. I mean, for some of you, it still might. At the end of the day, you have free will. But the cards are telling me that there's going to be more tempting offer that's probably going to make you stay. So I'm getting that you're staying rather than going and making that trip or, or move or whatever this is. Um, this strength card reversed. I wonder if it's you not being in a manager's position or you not getting a promotion because you're going to do your own thing. Earth signs that could be on the cards. So if you don't get that position, some of you have been trying to level up and get noticed for your talents. Or trust me, your talents are being noticed. Maybe not financially. Um, but then I, I feel like you're going to go and do your own thing, which is better. It's going to give you more autonomy. And you're moving out of that Eight of Swords where you are confused or you have this mental fogginess because um, that's reversed. So I feel like things could be a lot easier here for you. Um which is good. I feel like eight of wands reverse, these witches on the broomstick, it's reversed. So what I'm seeing here is that you, uh, the future holds a major, major friendship group that's going to be crumbled. Okay. You might've known these people all your life. You might've trusted them with your life, but there's something major that's going to happen between all of you. And you're going to disassociate yourself from them. And trust me, when I say this, it's a blessing in disguise. When the time happens, you'll be devastated. But I want to say to you, and hopefully you remember this, it could have been a lot worse. Okay, it's just the tip of the iceberg what you saw about this person. That's all I'm going to say about that. Don't want to scare you too much, but it's all for a reason. So I've got Aries here that is reversed here as well. So I could be with an Aries friend, uh, an Aries lover. Things might not work out in the future. Um, but this is good because you don't want that kind of relationship. This was a very controlling relationship or someone was trying to change you and make you do all these things that you weren't comfortable in doing. And the future's telling you to eliminate your stress. And the only way you'll come into power that way, Earth Signs, is by closing that chapter off which I feel like you will do. Your wishes, your your intuition, your higher self is going to take you in a different direction, but it's destined to be that way. Of course, you're going to have free will, so you'll have the power to change and choose as you wish it to, uh, but that doesn't mean certain circumstances won't show up in your life. Four of cups reversed here, four of cups upright here. Okay, something to do with the water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, is unfinished. They are stealing your future and they're going to come back in a very surprising slash unexpected slash dramatic way. So I'm seeing a grand gesture that's in your future coming from a water sign or someone who's very, very emotional. Uh, they may have water placement in their chart or they could just be a big baby, um, but they're going to come back and they're going to do something very big for you. It's hard to say what it is. I wouldn't be surprised if someone comes back down on bended knee and says marry me i want this to work um but it's gonna be pretty pretty intense so i feel like it's like a heart stopping jaw dropping scenario um so that's unfinished the universe has something to teach you about this person you may lose them again though in the future again free will is going to come into play here but there's a possibility that there is unfinished business in a sense where you need to learn a lesson with them and then you could go on to lose them the five of cups but the Five of Cups hasn't come up yet, so I'm not seeing that loss. Whether you want that to work out or not, it could very likely be successful, yes. I'm going to leave it there, though, of science. So thank you again for tuning in. It really does mean a lot. Um, don't forget to drop a like and also to subscribe to the channel. And I'm sure we'll be in touch again very, very soon. So lots of love. Thank you for all your support and viewership. And bye for now.